Good morning, everyone. I'm Rashi Vats, and this morning on Asian Connection, the upcoming Bayou City Art Festival in downtown Houston will feature more than 300 artists, along with food trucks, a kid zone, and obviously a lot of art. Chung Hu, one of the featured artists, is here this morning, along with executive director of the festival, Bridget Anderson, to invite us to the two-day event. It's mm -hmm. so exciting. So is this the first year that this has happened? No, this is the 44th year. We have one in the spring and one in the fall, and this is the fall venue that's downtown and city by city hall. Awesome. So I want I need to ask you, like, how did you decide you wanted to be a part of this? So one year I was traveling. Um, I met the resident artist at a national park, and she gave me the advice that if you want to get your artwork out there, show it to as many people as you can. So. We decided to chance it, join the art festival, and fortunately, we're one of the 300 artists that were chosen to exhibit this year. And Houston's mm -hmm. a great place. You mm -hmm. really get exposed to a lot of people. So what can people expect other than art? Well, there's 19 different mediums. There's going to be food trucks. There's going to be entertainment. There's going to be lots going on. Mm -hmm. But it's 300 artists from all over the nation. So it should be a great time. Green Energy, Mountain Energy is putting together a um, creative Kids zone, uh -huh. so the kids can become creative and artists while they're there. So it's kid friendly be, too. It's very kid friendly, very kid friendly, and um, the tickets are on sale online right now that are a little bit less than at the door, and so it should be a great time. And the weather's going to be beautiful, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> or get your water bottle ready. But That's it's right. amazing art. Speaking of art, you're looking at some of his work here. So talk to us a little bit about how you figure out what you're going to actually capture. So we're actually a wedding photographer here. In Houston and our style is really natural light photography and really vivid colors um, true to life and we want to bring that over to the landscape side so me and my wife decided that you know we want to get out there to the nature you know bring this beautiful landscape that you see that's gorgeous. in the best light as possible and try to capture it and show it to everybody do you ever mm -hmm. capture a picture and you're like wow that was great good job <laughs> <laughs> occasionally <laughs> occasionally yes. yes but you know oftentimes a lot of hard work you know a lot of patience waiting mm -hmm. for the good light to come up and you know just hope and uh, yeah when you get the shot sometimes it's like oh we got it yes yes oh that's awesome so is there any photograph that that really is one of your favorites yeah um, we're showing um, a Texas blue bonnet picture that is taken just south of Dallas uh -huh. that is very much one of the most popular pictures that uh, Houstonians love oh, and wow. this year we're bringing a new image that I shot this spring that was taken in Belgium it's the blue uh, blue Bluebell Forest. Are we seeing that on the screen right yes, now? Yes, we are. Oh, um, wow. That yeah. is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Well, um, when and where is the festival? Bridget? The festival is October 10th and 11th, and it's downtown by City Hall, and uh, there'll be parking at the Smith Garage, and it's going to be just a wonderful time for everybody, a great community event, and great artist, and a lot of fun. All right. Well, we definitely have to check that out. Thank you so much for being here. Be sure to join us again next time for more Asian Connection.